right here you have my uh, clownfish breeding setup. Uh, the main tank is a 50 gallon 3 feet tank divided into 3 sections. So you can see that I've uh, put some darkened glasses in between the sections just to ensure that the clownfish don't get startled by the neighbors. Okay. And over here we have the overflow as well as the return pump. And on the back of the overflow we can see that it has been designed in such a way that you actually stop the gurgling sound when the overflow happens. But if you remove this cap you can actually hear it. Okay. I learned this from another YouTube member who updated his YouTube with this design so I just copied it off it. Uh, you make sure that you need to drill a hole here so there's a tiny hole over there okay and down here we have the sump uh, it's powered by bubble magnus neck 3 I switched this on about 2 hours ago and as you can see it started to accumulate some stuff in the cup uh, the 3 overflow pipes coming down to a 7 inch diameter uh, slot net. Okay, and okay, one thing I'm going to mention here this skimmer is actually uh, the working range, rather, is actually between 8 to 10 inches of water. So, as you can see here, I have about roughly about 9.5 inches of water, the water level, okay. I'm quite lucky because if I had it anywhere higher, right, I would have to raise this. And I've already set it to the maximum setting. So if it goes any higher, I will have to remove some of the water. Okay. I've put in some live lock rocks. Uh, there's a piece of shrimp there. Oops. There. Okay. That's to start the cycling. Okay. Added in four bowls of. Uh, Pro D Bio stop ammo and bio digest. So we have the thermometer here, the ammo, ammonia checker here, and the return pump. An aquatic 3000. It goes back up to the top, okay, and goes and comes up from the overflow on top. Okay. Oh, this is just a holder for my garden hose. And I need to fill it up with fresh water. Uh, so that's it. I have the flower pots in there. So I'll wait for it to finish cycling and I'll add in some Nemos. And most probably I won't be adding in the normal clownfish. Uh, I'll try to select some special ones. Okay. Thanks guys.